Mario Golf Super Rush was released last week and I've been playing it all over the weekend, munching through the adventure mode where you play as your me character and progress up through the different courses and challenges, levelling up and applying stat points to increase power, speed, stamina, etc. You can also earn coins and use them to buy un well, all manner of new and funky golf clubs, outfits and items like the rangefinder. There are seven courses in total with more to come via free content updates as well as new cosmetic items and characters I'd imagine. Alongside the adventure mode is uh, solo challenges which is self-explanatory, a battle mode that pits up, uh, you and up to three other players online or offline where you have to basically you know, get your little golf ball into nine different holes with loads of obstacles in the way. There's standard golf, which is pretty much, again, self-explanatory, and speed golf, where all players tee off at the same time and then have to reach their ball to swing again, all with a time limit. All five modes are fun, and I especially had fun online with friends. There are 16 playable characters, including the usual roster of Nintendo guys like Mario, Luigi, Peach, Toad, Yoshi, etc., and the game does play great. Um, you can use a wide selection of tweaks and other tricks to guide your golf ball. Uh, all the uh, all the while fighting natural wind and classic Mario enemies and goddamn sand bunkers, quicksand, water, etc. The adventure mode can be frustrating at times in the later tournaments as it seems everything and its mother is against you. But, I mean, I like a challenge. Um, but sometimes it can get a bit too much. The only major gripe I have with the game is that graphically it's a little poor, especially compared to other Nintendo exclusives like Mario Kart 8, for example, which is just a shinier port from the Wii U, yet looks better than this, Mari this newly released Mario Golf game. The textures in Mario Golf are actually, well, quite poor in some areas, especially the rock textures. Kind of looks like N64 graphics. The draw distance isn't that great either and there can be a fair amount of pop in. However, overall the game is fun, if bare bones, for the time being. Uh, you know, there's, it's more fun online with other players, especially with friends, and you can also use motion controls as, uh, as well as standard controls, which I imagine is uh, a lot of fun. I don't really use uh, motion controls, I stick with standard controls because I'm too old to be fannying about with all that crap. But Oh, overall, uh, Mario Golf Super Rush gets a 7 out of 10 from me. It's a fun and good game, but it's not as polished and detailed as other Nintendo exclusives or even other Mario sports games. It's worth getting if you're into the Mario sports uh, game genre. However, I wouldn't worry about getting it now or on release, especially if they're going to be adding free content updates. I just hope this isn't a growing trend with Nintendo where they release these kind of games bare bones and then add to it consistently over time. Uh, they did avoid that for a long time, but I don't know. I mean, hopefully I'm wrong, but let's just hope for the best. But thank you very much for watching, and until next time.